Hello YouTube, this is uh, Odyssey here and uh, today I'm going to show you how to fix the flickering screen error on the game FTL or Faster Than Light um, This is a pretty awesome game uh, that it's right now on Steam um, However, uh, there is um, this known issue that uh, whenever you're playing, if you click on the, on the screen, it flickers a lot and if you click actually a little bit too much to some users it actually minimizes into the taskbar now I've seen a lot of posts on the forums uh, from Steam and on the forums from the developer unfortunately our pleas for help have gone uh, pretty much unattended um, it seems that um, they have not been able to isolate what is the root cause of this problem However, be, be me the nice guy that I am uh, I found a solution that I w I'm going to share it with everybody I'm also going to... Uh, well, if this works for you uh, I will try to share it uh, with the developers as well uh, so that they can post it on, on their forums uh, so far I have been able to fix this on a Windows 8 and a Windows 7 computer one running an AMD card and one an NVIDIA card uh, doesn't make any real difference on that one uh, still let's get into it first of all I'm gonna show you what is the error or how it looks like um, I'm gonna open my library here here it is and I'm just going to launch the game now this error happens whether you're full screen or on windowed mode uh, right now switch switching to windowed mode because uh, I was having some problems recording the error on full screen but pretty much it happens on both I'm on the latest version I'm just gonna hit continue here and this is what happens you start clicking on stuff and you're gonna see the window popping up and down you see that? doesn't matter what you do, doesn't matter where you're clicking it just starts flickering and makes the whole thing very unplayable or at least uh, harder than it already is <laughs> okay so as you're seeing right now you pretty much you don't even have to click, it sometimes flickers on its own <laughs> well that's the error we're gonna quit this thing here so the big question here, how do we fix it? pretty easily we gotta uh, navigate to where the local files of the game are you wanna go to your main hard drive and go to program files uh, you go to steam And if you're not using a Steam or if you're using a, a vanilla or a, or a free copy version of this, uh, you're gonna have you're gonna uh, search it under Program Files FTL. And well, in the case of a Steam, you wanna go to Steam Apps. You wanna hit the Common folder, and here it is. This is pretty much uh, your game library on Steam. So obviously, you open a FTL faster than light. We're gonna get a bunch of files here. Uh, there is, we are looking for this one, ftlgame.exe. Don't worry if you are not able to see the .exe part. Not everybody can because sometimes the extensions are hidden by Windows. Doesn't really make a difference. It's the only one with this name. So we're gonna make a right click on it. Go to properties, and we're going to the compatibility tab right here. We're going to enable compatibility for Windows XP Service Pack 3. We're going to run it on reduced color mode on 16 bit. And we're going to disable the display scaling. Alright, pretty much this is going to prevent the game from changing uh, the scaling. And it's going to adjust to the refreshing rate of our monitor. Those of you tech guys, geeky guys, gamers, I know you know what I mean. Uh, the other ones, just make sure that there's a check mark here. <laughs> And finally, you want to click on run this program as an administrator. Hit apply. Hit OK. And you can launch the game from here or you can launch from Steam. It doesn't really make a difference. We're going to hit play again. Yeah. You're going to get prompted if you want to run it as an administrator. Loading game. There it 
this. All right, we click continue, and now we are gonna start clicking everywhere. As you can see, the error is no longer showing up. Make it on my crew. Got this guy here. It's probably over here. Got this other guy here. And right now the game is playable, which is an awesome thing. No more flickering, no more issues. Or, you may as well say, issue resolved. Thank you, Odyssey. <laughs> well, try this. Uh, if you're experiencing this problem, I'm pretty sure it's going to help you fix it. And uh, let me know how it, uh, how it went. How it work on the comments uh, for you uh, if it really work well just remember to like and subscribe thank you once again YouTube this is Odyssey checking out have a good day